What's up world? It's your boy Alfred. I'm here coming at you with another video. I had a crazy adventure today and I lost the footage from my original intro so I'm recording this after the fact. So just kick back, relax, and enjoy the rest of this 20 something minute video. Wow. It is really dark in this car. It is. Sorry, I don't have any here. But we are here and uh, we're going. Huge shout out to my boy Tyler, the shadowy figure over there. What's up? For uh, giving me a ride. We're already buckled up, but I guess buckle up for this ride that is going to take absolutely forever. So we're taking a gas station break. Zip code. Zip code. It's a good question. Is it going to be like my back home zip code or my huge zip code? Wherever you got your card. Hang on, I'm going to pause this. We at gas station number two. It's one step closer to the ultimate goal, to conquer all those stupid Area 51 guards that don't want us to see aliens. Frick you, government. Oh, look at all the Kyle juice. So much Kyle juice in here. I'd pop some right now, but I'm, I'm not ready to go all out just yet. Gotta save my energy for the rate. Uh, it's, um... I can make it better for you. It's after midnight. Um, we just passed the Nevada sign, and uh, my brain is like super zoned out right now, so I don't really have much to say. This road's nice though. The other road was nicer. It's the same road. We've been on the same road for like, oh! It's okay, I saw it. I knew it. I almost just cussed on video. <laughs> I wonder if I got that on video. Did you did y'all see that coyote? That was a fox. Fox, whatever, I don't know. It was either a fox or a pygmy coyote. Pygmy coyote. We're gonna go with that answer. I like that answer better than fox. Well, now that I've had the living bejeebus scared out of me. Okay. Well, it's uh, I think it's what what time is it? Let me check. It's one. It's one a.m. We're in the uh, the first town we've seen in like hours, hours and hours. Just been in the middle of nowhere for forever, and we only hit one rabbit on the way here. So I'd say we're doing pretty good. We didn't hit any of the antelope. That was terrifying. Um, yeah, I can't I can't recommend driving in the middle of Nevada in the middle of the night because there's scary animals everywhere that want to die. They want to just jump in front of your car and kill themselves. So just for future reference, don't do not do this. Kids, don't go to Area 51 at home. What am I talking about? I'm done. Oh, you, that, that thing you said earlier about how like, you know, didn't some people get like murdered from that? That's what people are going to be saying in a few days about Area 51. I just saw reflective lights way off in the distance. Uh, we are clearly being hunted by antelope. Do rocket launchers have reflectors on them? <laughs> I feel like that would be anti-productive. Like, no. Hey guys, look where I am. <laughs> nah. <laughs> The only <laughs> the image I have in my <laughs> We've got two hours left. Come on, man. <laughs> I can't I can't keep it together. The image I have in my head is it's just like this antelope <laughs> in a bush following us with a rocket launcher. Oh my gosh. Keeping up with us at like seventy eight miles an hour. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Antelope are that fast. It hasn't even shot it because it doesn't need to. It's just walking with our car. <laughs> and the crazy thing is, <laughs> you know, to use a rocket launcher, you need hands. And so he's running on his back legs only. <laughs> uh, this should not be as funny as it is, but it's also like 1 a.m. 1, 1 a.m. Um, yeah, that's right. Yep. That's right. Oh man. I've been driving for four and a half hours. It says 145 miles to Tonopah. That's our destination. 145 miles. 
Remember that time it started raining on us? I, I didn't record it that. Three times. It happened three times? Yeah. Man. Did I fall asleep or something? No, I just think you stopped paying attention. I'm really good at that. You are amazing at that. I'm so good at not paying attention. <laughs> That's why every deer I've seen has been next to the car. I don't see it until we, it's next to the car. And then I'm like, oh. better than me. I haven't seen a single one yet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for all Tyler knows, I'm just pulling his leg about all these deer. He hasn't seen one of them. No, I swear, I've seen, I've seen four deer now. And I don't even know how many antelope because these antelope are freaking sneaky. It's like... Oh, so it's like army crawling through the bushes with this rocket launcher at 78 miles an hour. Yeah, pretty much. It's army crawling on its back legs. At 78 miles an hour. <laughs> I think you army crawl on your stomach. Nope. <laughs> Not into them. Is that the target for the rocket launcher? Uh, are we screwed right now? Oh, three, two, one. Insert explosion edit here, <laughs> future Luke. Never mind. <laughs> I'm not going to. Uh, I'd have to put a watermark on this video. School bus stop ahead. Does that mean we'll pass the school bus? Wait, what? Did you seriously just see school bus stop ahead? Yep. Who lives out here? I was just going to say, I'm way more scared of getting hit by an antelope right now than I am of getting arrested at Area 51. It's because you're not going to be stupid at Area 51. It's for true. For the most part. I'm only going to be, you know, I'm only going to drive like 14 hours we should really start collecting for a meme video. <laughs> I'm literally doing this for a meme video. A meme video. And what am I YouTube. doing it for? Uh, that's a good question. What are you... Tyler, why are you here? I own a car. Okay. <laughs> Insert, why are we still here, edit. <laughs> That's one I could actually do if I felt like putting in the effort. But I, it's probably funnier this way. Oh man, I'm on a trip right now. You are on a trip right now. In more ways than one though. Insert uh, pun, edit, here? Yes. Uh, stop clip. So I don't really have anything to show here. Well, you know, aside from the fact that we hit another rabbit, that, that was that was exciting. Right under both wheels. Yeah, he, he went under both wheels. He's gone. Willingly. Um, but so the news is, we're less than six miles away from Tonopah, or however you pronounce that. But the main the main thing. The main thing, we just passed a sign that said airport, and it was pointing to the south. You can't see, but that's my finger pointing south. And that is the direction of Area 51. We literally just passed Area 51, and the hype is real. On the GPS. Seven minutes till we reach Tonopah, and the hype is real right now, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I'm actually really excited for this. I don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow, but this is gonna be really fun. Wow, this is this is some quality recording right here. Okay, well, we made it. We're in Tonopah, Nevada. And we're currently chilling in a Burger King parking lot. <laughs> not even, it's a gas station parking lot with an attached Burger King. Yeah, so it's like not even a real Burger King. It's like a fake Burger King. Um. So we're here, we're gonna sleep, so we can get our energy, so we can take down this Air Force base tomorrow, get their aliens, free our brothers from another star system. That sounds good. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave that there. Just I almost dropped my phone. Uh, well, we survived the first night. And the only night that we're gonna spend out here, because that was terrible. <laughs> so freaking cold. <laughs> Deserts are cold at night. Don't believe what they tell you. Deserts are not hot all the time. It's a lie. 
Um, so now that we're here and we're awake, I don't know. We're here and we're awake. Maybe we'll go get some Burger King. That sounds good. Get some Burger King. After we there. warm up. Yeah, after we're not freezing to death. So that when we open the door, we'll be cold again. It's great. Exactly. But hey, I feel like in Burger King, they'll have heaters. <sighs> also, the sun just barely came up around the corner. And I'm blind. Uh, we've been here for a little bit, and we haven't seen very many raiders around. And so I'm like, how are we going to get recruits? And then the answer was obvious. Zombies! <laughs> Get that one there. Hey! Hey, Michael! Come on, get up! Time to go! David, my man! What's up, bro? I haven't seen you ever in my life. Uh, it's time. Let's go. Let's get these aliens. Uh, Tommy! What's up, dude? Let's go! Come on! Got it. Gotta find aliens. Um, Wilbur, my man. Vernon? Wesley? Why are they all dudes? There's no women here. This graveyard is sexist. There's no women. We're leaving. This is the road that goes to Area 51. Uh, it's actually pretty long. There's like nothing here. So what you're basically saying is after this year's been back into town, I can guess. I think uh, uh, yes. We're gonna go with that. Dang, there's like nothing out here. I don't even see it, like where it's supposed to be. It's just emptiness. Guys, I think Area 51's a scam. It's it's not real. It doesn't exist. It's not a real place. You remember those those satellite images? Ah, it's Photoshop. Remember that video that Mr. Beast made? Me neither. You guys, I don't know if you can see this, but there's stuff down there. And. I feel like that's Area 51. Oh dang it. It went all blurry, no. Guys, we, we out here, we doing this. Oh dang. Yep. I think that's it over there. Let's see these aliens. This is as close as I feel comfortable with getting to Area 51. It's right there. Like this is it. We made it. We need a picture. Uh, yes. Picture time. All right. Well, um, we're here alone. Let's go get some backup or something. <laughs> Let's turn around. <laughs> Sounds good to me. <clears throat> well, uh, this is definitely not us just wimping out. No, absolutely not. This is big brain moves. We are going to get help. I, I'm like now really scared to go speed limit. <laughs> <laughs> All of a sudden, we were going like 110 on the way here. And now I'm going 45. <laughs> yep. Don't break the law, kids. You'll die. So, uh, no, we did not chicken out. We did not leave yet. As you can see, Area 51 is right over there. We were just not sufficiently prepared for the attack at this time. So, right here, I have some Kyle juice, and uh, we're gonna use some of this to blast straight through that gate. And I know, like, I know you can't see right now, but there's gotta be Naruto runners all over the place hiding in the grass. I mean, they're ninjas. They can, they can do that kind of thing. So if I just go through the gate with this, then 
we got this. We got this in the bag. So. We're going to start by just taking a look Drywall. I'll take it out. Oh, I, I hate my stepdad. Oh. All right, we're off. We're off. That was that was crazy, you guys. That was crazy. All right, all right. We're going full send it. Full send it. Full send this time. It's a really long walk over there. I think I'm... I think I'm good. Tyler. Yeah. I have some bad news. What's that? What if I told you? that we raided the wrong Area 51. <laughs> oh no. So, I had a hunch. Things didn't seem right. And after doing some research, the Tanupa Test Range Air Force, Air, Air Force Base, whatever it is, is not, it's not Area 51. Area 51 is close, but they're different. I got confused when I was doing my research. And, uh, so yeah, we took down the wrong Area 51. I, you still have some Kyle juice? I still have some Kyle juice. <laughs> so we did not find Area 51. What we did find was an alien festival in Rachel. Um, this isn't really what we came for. Uh, you just want to go in here? Um, no, no. Man, this is not what we're here for. We're here to raid Area 51. But this is not it. This is not Area 51. We started going down a road that led to the actual place and some dude was like, yo, this is private property. Uh, you can't come down here. And we're kind of like, that's probably bogus. There wasn't even any private property signs or anything. He probably just wants to keep anyone out of there. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that. There's like a cloud of smoke there or something. It's either a cloud of smoke or it's a dust tornado. So we found the alien festival. But no aliens. This is just a bunch of people chilling around, probably smoking weed. Um, yeah, not what I came for. Hashtag not interested. Okay, so after being blocked on the other road, we went all the way through alien stock and we ended up here at the other road, which leads to Area 51. If you can see it, there's a bunch of people that are like going back and forth along the road, creating a lot of dust clouds. And like, a bunch of people just seem to be coming back. So, I don't think anyone's actually making it down there. 
and I don't know. I don't really see too much of the point in trying to go anymore. <laughs> uh, I don't know. What do you think, Tyler? I kind of want to see this uh, Prius knockoff try to make it. Uh, the the Prius isn't gonna make it. The Prius is gonna make it like two feet down the road and break down. I wonder what those dudes are doing in the RVs over there. Maybe it's Mr. Beast. Hi, Mr. Beast! Okay, cool. I said hi to Mr. Beast. I raided uh, the Tonopah <laughs> Air Force Base. Um, we drove through Alien Stock. I'd, I'd say it's a pretty successful day. I Des think so. Despite how it did not go as planned at all, I'll take it. I'm just going to end the video here because I have a life and I have stuff to do, so I'll just go go do that. So thank you for watching this video of where I raided the wrong Area 51. Uh, maybe next year I'll raid the real one. We'll see. Anyways, peace out, dudes.